ahead and call the meeting to order. Everybody join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Morning. All right, go ahead and consider a motion to approve the agenda this morning. So moved, Madam Chair. Second. Thank you. And we'll move on to our opportunity for public comment. If there's anyone in the audience wishing to address the board, come on up. Can, can we vote huh? on the Oh, sorry. Motion? Whoops. Yes, Sean, we call the roll. Commissioner Ahrens? Yes. Commissioner Gibbon? Yes. Commissioner Pop? Yes. Commissioner Landin? Yes. <laughs> now we'll move to the opportunity for public comment. Uh, Betty Yatton, 4678 73rd Street in T. Um, I know that you have the um, amended 22 provisional budget um, up for, um, uh, and I'm wondering if that's the one that's already um, printed or already on the internet or if you're um, actually making it a deeper dive. That's it. Thank you. Anybody else? If not, move on to the commissioner reports, if there are any. All right. I mean, I'm sure. All right. I'll move on then to regular business and the first reading. This is the first reading for an ordinance of Lincoln County, South Dakota, amending the joint zoning regulations for Lincoln County and the city of Sioux Falls by amending Article 9C, commercial district, and Article 24, definitions. Is Toby going to come up and handle no. this? Toby is not here. How about anybody from the state's attorney's office? All right. Well, this is just our first reading. So don't need anything from us on it, do you? Okay. We'll just go ahead and move on to our um, approval to advertise amended provisional budget. Um, I met with department heads last week, um, or I think it was, yeah, last week after our meeting, and um, they, um, I asked them to come up with some additional adjustments that they could make to their budget um, so that we could re-advertise our provisional budget um, with those changes. So that's what we're asking for today is approval to advertise this amended um, provisional budget and then we'll have a hearing on September 7th. Madam Chair, I would so move to authorize to advertise the amended budget. Thank you. Is there a second? I'll second it. Thank you. Sean, may you call the roll? Commissioner Ahrens. Uh, before we call the roll, I would like to have some discussion on the motion. Sure, go ahead. What are the changes? Um, you should have a list. Uh, Sherry, did you give everybody a list? I did. So in front of you, Joel, there's a one piece of paper that says changes to the provisional budget. Do you have that? Yeah, this is the first I've seen it. So I sure. haven't seen it. Uh, I didn't get all the requested changes until yesterday. That's why there wasn't any documents sent out to you because it took me a little while to prepare it also. So yes, these are cuts that the offices have gone through, not that they want to, but that they can, they can make. Um, also I made, went through the payroll and I tightened that down a little bit more because there was health insurance elections. So that's where those changes come from. For the payroll. And I think was it a, a total of about 350,000? Yep. That yep. the departments came up with? Yep, it was 127 in payroll alone. Okay. Just because of election changes for health insurance. Um, yeah, then the rest of it would be departmental, what they're willing to cut. 
So I see a lot of it, auditor, treasurer, general building, veteran service, GIS, a lot of just decreases in supplies and materials. But when I get to floodplain management, I see decreased fees in contract, 100,000. What is that? Um, I believe that was him taking out a project, or was it taking out the extra person? I'll have to call John down here to discuss it. I just got numbers from them. Okay. And then planning and zoning was a decrease in fees and contract of 75000 Yep, the email that I got from Toby said that he is going to take out the um, comprehensive plan that he had requested. Okay. And then furniture and minor equipment he lowered by 5000 And then do we have an actual copy of what is being published? Yes, it's up on your desk. Is that what we're calling proposed? This one right here? Yep. Okay. I'm, I think John's not here, but I think what he was, his thought was, um, I hate to speak for people, but I think his thought was is that he wasn't going to do any more projects for floodplain, that he would take that out. That's my recollection as well. Now, in our budget books, I noticed that uh, on the provisional budget that's being proposed here, it gives line items 100, 110, 111, 112. Uh, but in the budget books we're given as commissioners, there's even subline items. For example, I'm looking at uh, one, uh, an example here. It says 101 general fund judicial, and it gives a line item. This is just as an example 101 4130 4221. Uh, that seems to be the more detailed or specific uh, budget that we spend money on per line item, right? Yep. Okay. Well, I'm going to make a motion to amend the motion to publish, and my motion to amend is going to be that we publish the budget uh, document with the uh, all of the sub-line items that we're given as commissioners here. So yep, that's and what I did is, because that document is pretty bulky, I... I mean, I don't know if you want to pay the publishing to publish 54 pages of documents. Um, it is available online. So what is getting published online then? Which one? Both of them are getting on. Both of them are online. This is all the document before you, the big one, is all I'm statutorily required to publish in the newspaper. Yeah, that, that's the minimum, but that doesn't mean we can't go further. Right, and that's why I put it online. So hold on, I can look online here at what version is online. Well, sure. the current, the version that you're requiring to publish today is not online. It's the old one. Okay. So, Sherry, what, what do you, do you have any idea what cost would be to publish the whole thing? No, because it's never been done. Not that it can't be done. It's just never been done. I'd have to give them a booklet. It'd be a flyer in the newspaper probably because it's 54 pages. Yeah, I think it's uh, in the interest of transparency. Uh, but it's online. Yeah, I think the... Uh, this is the online website right now. Okay, so this is online. Yep. All right. And can we put in the uh, one that we publish in the newspapers, go, go to that website? Yep, it's online as okay. well. So it'll say go to that website for further details. Well, I mean, yes, yes, I can. Okay, yep. let's do that. And then that way people who only read the newspaper and don't have computers, if they want to know more, they yep. can go to the library and go to the website, figure yep. it out. And I think uh, 
This is much more helpful for taxpayers to be able to see this. And just so people know, what's being published right there is what's given to the commissioners. Mm -hmm. that, is, that is the drilled down document. Yep. So I think that will be very helpful for the public to review and uh, very transparent. So we have... We have a motion on the table. Um, it was a motion to publish the provisional, the amended provisional. Yes. Yeah, what is that? Commissioner Jibben did second the motion. No. Well, we didn't deal with the first motion, so we're going to do that first. Sherry was, Sherry was clarifying my motion to say, basically. You don't need to amend it because that is what she's going to publish. I just don't know if, as part of your motion, whether you incorporated into your motion the publishing of that document she just had on the screen or you just intended for the basic one to be published. On the newspaper My, my, in okay, Commissioner, you made the motion, Commissioner yeah, Poppins. So what I'm referring to is Mike, can you use your microphone? Sorry, I, don't know. I know he hasn't amended, but no, we okay. already had a motion and a second on the Thank first, you. so we're going to move forward on that one. So I think the clarification was what is actually going to be published. So, Commissioner Ahrens, are you still thinking we need an amended motion? No, I'll withdraw the amended motion um, so long as that document uh, that we saw there on the screen just now with all the subline items is published on the internet. And that is the case. That was my plan. Okay. All right. So with that, then I'd like, um, if there's no further discussion, I'd like Sean to call the roll on the pending motion. Commissioner Ahrens. Yes. Commissioner Gibbon. Yes. Commissioner Poppins. Yes. Commissioner Landine. Yes. Motion carries. We didn't have any need for an executive session today, did we? Not that I know. Okay. I would offer a motion to adjourn. Thank you. Is there a second? I'll second, second. it. Thank you. I got a motion and a second by Commissioner Gibbon. Sean, we call the roll. Commissioner Ahrens. Yes. Commissioner Gibbon. Yes. Commissioner Poppins. Yes. Commissioner Landine. Yes. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day. Thank you, day. everyone.